photosynthesis and in this video we're only dealing with stage two which is the dark stage or the Calvin cycle. So we've already covered in a previous video the light stage reactions, now we're going on to the dark stage. The dark stage is sometimes called the light independent stage and you're often asked to explain this. It's basically because light is not involved in these reactions at all. It's the products of the light stage that are essential, NADPH and ATP. So where in the chloroplast do the dark stage reactions take place? They take place in the liquid part of the chloroplast, the stroma. And it's important to know that the stroma contains many enzymes. So the reactions of the dark stage or the Calvin cycle, they are enzyme controlled and that's important to remember. Whereas the light stage reactions, they are not because they happen too quickly. So let's move on to the dark stage reactions or the Calvin cycle as it's sometimes known. And you'll find that this is much more straightforward than the light stage. So what happens in the dark stage? It all begins with NADPH, which was formed in the light stage and it was formed by NADP plus trapping two high energy electrons and a proton. Well, now NADPH is going to transfer those electrons and protons and they are going to combine with carbon dioxide and in a complex series of reactions, eventually glucose will be formed. These reactions are fueled by the breakdown of ATP and when ATP breaks down, it forms ADP and a phosphate. ATP was also made in the light stage. Once those electrons and the proton are transferred, NADP plus is going to return to the light stage. And once ATP is broken down, ADP and a phosphate will also return to the light stage. So we'll just run through that in note form. It's always good to have notes. So NADPH transfers electrons and protons. They're going to combine with carbon dioxide. And these reactions are fueled by the energy released from the breakdown of ATP. Eventually glucose is formed. And all of this process where glucose is formed is an anabolic process. Where did the NADPH come from? The light stage. Where did the ATP come from? Formed in the light stage. And what's returning to the light stage after the transfer and the breakdown? NADP plus is going back to the light stage and ADP and a phosphate will return to the light stage. So that was the dark stage. That's as simple as it can get, I think. So remember, do pass papers and check the marking schemes because I bet you can do most of the questions now. And um, best of luck.